That's why we will create what I call an opportunity economy, an opportunity economy where everyone has the chance to compete and a chance to succeed. Whether you live in a rural area, small town, or big city, and as president, I will bring together labor and workers and small business owners and entrepreneurs and American companies to create jobs, to grow our economy, and to lower the cost of every day. What are you going to be? Are you, are you, what are you, a headhunter? Are you feel, like, what are you talking about? What does that mean? Does it mean anything? Again, a left winger would say, I will help American workers get their fair share of the profits that these corporations are creating and instead of sending them to overseas shareholders we're going to keep those profits here at home and everyone's going to earn a living wage everybody who works a full-time job should have a secure living in this country that's what a left-wing person would say what she's saying is actually what republicans say this is actually republican framing this is right-wing framing of the economy which is it is the government's job to smooth over the conflicts so that the workers get back to work you know like this is this is such a bad speech ideologically you know we talked a lot about this before with tim walls we talked about how saying the you know the difference between someone who says worker and somebody who says middle class the difference between somebody who talks about corporate profits or unions as a right or, you know, uh, a person who claps along with the crowd versus a person who lets themselves, who basks in the applause. Like, these are all, like, subtle little things. And every subtle thing that Kamala is doing in this speech is right-wing.